Okay, so where do I start? I guess everything happens for a reason and with a goal in mind. But sometimes there are some problems that arise when you care a lot for the thing that you're trying to do. Let me show you. So for the past three months, uh, that goal was quite simple. I needed to make uh, a live room that would be viable for a professional recording studio. Not as much as the size goes because it's quite a small room as it is, but as far as soundproofing goes. I knew that uh, I would be able to work in, not alone, without annoying the very understanding and lovely neighbors that I have right here. From the start there were going to be several challenges regarding this construction because uh, the things uh, that could be done here were quite uh, limited because of the situation here. To be clear, the studio is uh, on the first floor so that uh, greatly limited uh, the amount of things we could do because of the whole structural things. So the heavier constructions were eliminated. At the same time, there was also the build uh, of the control room which had uh, quite less uh, soundproofing needs and it was a far easier job to be done. But regarding this room, the first construction started with a few questions on my part uh, as far as uh, the level of soundproofing that would be done in here. But the engineer I hired had a certain way of doing things uh, and I didn't really want to step uh, into his work. The thing is that from the start I had some doubts regarding this construction as far as the materials go and the way they were implemented in this room. And the bad thing is that I really needed to speak uh, a little bit sooner than I did. Because what happened was that uh, the whole room was built and during the test uh, we found out that uh, the level of soundproofing that was done here really wasn't up to my expectations and the thing that I wanted to do here. I understand that 100% soundproofing can't be done in this place due to the limitations that I talked about but uh, I really thought that something better could be achieved with a smarter placement of the materials at hand. So that's it for the fourth update regarding the studio build that's going on. I really hope that the next video that I will do for this place will be when it is complete and it will be done in the new control room. That's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Talam and I'll see you in the next one.